to hit the ground at the same time. It is well known that in the absence of air, a feather and a hammer fall exactly at the same time, because gravity accelerates all objects equally, regardless of their mass. On Earth, of course, this is not the case due to the aerodynamic drag force. Now, this drag force depends on the object's size and shape, but not on their mass. And this makes many people wrongly state that two objects with the same size and shape but different masses will also fall at the same time. We can do the experiment in just a few meters are enough to see that it's not true. The heavier ball always falls faster, so what's going on here? Thinking like this. In the first instant, both balls begin accelerating equally due to gravity. Shortly after that, they undergo the same drag force due to their equal speed, but this drag force causes a different deceleration on both, due to their different mass. Thus, the next drag force will also be different and so will be the evolution of both velocities from this point. If you understand this, you understand how to numerically solve differential equations, but this is going to come in an extended version of this video.